This video will demonstrate how to wirelessly connect with your laptop or desktop computer using a mobile device, specifically a tablet. Um, in this video I'll, I'll be using my HP touchpad and my MacBook Pro. I'll also show how to connect to Windows 7. Uh, so the first thing you're going to do uh, is get the Splashtop Remote app on your mobile device. Uh, you can get this with the Apple Store, uh, Android Marketplace, or the WebOS. Um, it does cost uh, some money, I believe up to $20 for full price. Um, sometimes it's on sale, I got it for, for $5 recently. Um, but you can download it. Then on your computer, go to the Splashtop Remote site and download Splashtop Streamer for either Windows or Mac, depending obviously. And that is how you'll connect. And on the Mac you can see that it's on and it's ready to use. So go over here and open up remote and it'll start connecting. And the first time you do this you'll be asked to basically make a, a password. Now I've already done that and so now the two are connected. So it gives you some hints as to how to tap, double tap, right click, so it's left click, double click, right click, uh, you can scroll and stuff. Um, but here you can see the same thing that I have on my computer, right here. Um, you can see that it's Safari and all my applications down there. The recommendation that I would make uh, if you're doing this on your Mac would be to make sure that your dock is visible so then you can click on, on the applications Otherwise, if you hide it, which I normally do, um, then you really, I, I've, I don't really, I wasn't able to actually access the dock um, otherwise. Um, you can change the display settings to one that would be more kind of optimized for the, the tablet. Um, and if you sort of zoom and play with it on your computer, yeah, uh, you can get it to sort of. You can get it to appear in the full screen. You can zoom in and out with this. You can scroll using two fingers to go up and down. Sometimes you have to worry about um, zooming when you're trying to scroll. So what I recommend doing, um, I can't show you because I'm holding the camera with the other finger, but um, is to put a thumb on both sides, so a thumb here and a thumb over there and actually sort of scroll them together and that'll that'll work a lot better so you kind of avoid the accidental um, zoom. Um, so anyway, I'll just show you, you know, you, like I said, you can access everything. Um, you know, there's my iTunes. Um, I've got an Excel sheet open. Um, so, you know, you can see, this is for my thesis project, um, but uh, uh, so you can see that you can use that. Um, for those of us who are HP touchpad users, uh, one of the nice features of this is that it allows you to play Netflix uh, on your touchpad. Don't want to get any copyright problems, but um, so that you can watch t uh, Netflix on there. You can go to full screen. It, it goes a little bit buggy at full screen. It'll kind of give you a little like, um, I don't know if it's, an, it's not exactly a lag, but kind of a little skip every now and then, but it's still watchable. Um, if you watch it in this mode, it, in, in, right in the browser, it's, it pretty much works perfectly. Um, so you can have access to everything on your on your computer. You can play games if you want. Um, you have the keyboard that pops up. As you notice up here, you know you have special uh, the, like the command function and everything like that. So you can, um, you know, tab over to do things. Um, you also have you know the option if you have Mac, Mac OS X. My son, right. If you have Mac OS X line, you can use Mission Control. And then I have, right now, I have Windows running in the um, VMware Fusion, so kind of like Parallels. It works perfectly with the already downloaded Mac uh, version of the uh, streamer. To switch back and forth, you will need to then use the command function with tab, and then you can just switch back over. All right, so I've now rebooted into Boot Camp. Um, so I'm just on 
just on the PC side, you know, there's no going back and forth anything. Um, you know, strictly PC here, strictly Windows 7. And I just downloaded the Splashtop streamer um, for the for this computer, so we'll see how it works. Um, I will put in my code. Okay, and we're finished. Now, what I will try to do then is see if I can access this another way. And it works. It says WebOS is connected to the computer. You get the same message. Um, now it looks like the, the display might be a little bit different, so I can go in and edit that, but you know, so you can still zoom, scroll, everything works. You can see um, just a demonstration of how the video works on the Windows only side. Um, I'll show you one of my video of my trip to Scotland. So works pretty well. Um, the keyboard, as you can see, it has Windows specific functions there. And you can move through um, and see everything. 